Hi everyone, Alina here. Welcome to my channel. And today I like to introduce for you our new book. So we have a, like its diary book for a nail art. So it's not only about nail art, it's as well about planner, it's about create your own designs. So we have in here a small um, application like top coat and basic things, what normally most of the people know, just for in case. And there we have a pictures how to apply your are press on nails so you are uh, and how to remove your press on nails so it's not about only art it's about press on nails as well in here we can measure the sizes how we can measure the size uh, which uh, number we have it uh, for a press on nail how to create press on nail you can uh, find it underneath of this video I keep a link there so I have it there how I am create step by step uh, my nails and here we have a like brush watch brushes for what so which one we use it which one it's fine which one it's not fine so like that as well you can see all the way what you have to do in here we have uh, some nice nail art uh, with some 3d let's say eyes so you can draw um, on top and you can wipe it it's laminated so you can uh, quite um, gently a lot of practicing and wipe it and practicing and wipe it it's all about eyes a different mimic and different colors so in here we have you can as well practice a little bit just to try uh, it's most of the art it's done in here very basic some nail art with mickey mouse with the some goofy with some uh, kitty hello kitty uh, you can see as well it's not very very bright designs it's make easier for you to apply on top because if it's going to be too black if it's going to be very bright design it's quite complicated as well to cover you cannot see where you cover it where you not but in here you can as well create your own design and you can do not only with a uh, gel paint you can use as well a um, actual pencil in here as well we have some different art uh, we have some uh, like goofy and um, uh, what they call it um, gummy bee we have some design what is horses and like simple design uh, for me it's remind this like tattoos in here we have as well like mickey mouse and all that as well like i say for you uh, the, the, it's not very very black uh, it's easier for um, put on top and drawing art for you can see exactly where you're drawing uh, here we have a different as well princess style here we have uh, uh, butterflies uh, in here we have different nail art you can as well practice in on top wipe it when you feel like they all laminated in here we have practicing it's perfect when people never draw or if you just beginner and you didn't have a um, draw you know like experience with nail art even if you are a, a long time nail technician but you still don't have experience with the nail art it's much easier to little bit practice it to make your um, hand warmer like before you exercise you move warm up so it's exactly the same and then you draw something then we have as well more for practicing and then we start to create our design so for example we have here uh, our design so i'm writing here it's designer it's me uh, or maybe you see somewhere in instagram some design some um, inspiration you know so you can uh, write in here uh, what it's the name of the nail artist or you can write in here as well name of the artist here you can do a design for example you can do like this one it's going to be with swirls it's going to be with stones it's going to be with this and that so uh, and um, in here you can put it a number of the color what you use so for example you use uh, blue uh, gel polish uh, 26 so you put in here blue 26 what exactly gel polishes you use all this design and in here what it's look like uh, in the end so if you wanted to create or you can create some different design as well it's up to you so it's quite a lot of pages like that to make your own uh, design and plan your design and in here it's more a different design where for example you see some as well some inspiration on instagram 
or something like maybe like no, not plain but French or some design with the 3D flowers. So you can create here and here you can put, okay, I like to have this and this gel polish colors. In here I, you can write, uh -huh, I like to have this and this stones. Uh, you can do costage, you can say, for example, this stones or this 3D design, it's cost this much and this much. And you can see uh, as well and write in here cost of this design, how much it will be on total. I exactly the same like here as well. You normally put like time and days and then you put um, how many hours you do this nails one two three hours and how much it's cost and maybe client name if you are do already this design so as well it's quite a lot of pages like that for practicing and for a create your uh, design so it's like planner it's not only about nail art it's about plan your design create your design yourself in here we have a different as well option with the nail art. I'm like to practicing on uh, like this kind of um, design before long time ago when it's no heavy tips for a practicing. I was use plastic uh, from the Coca-Cola bottles. I'm just cut it nails like that draw like this and put it on top stick the nails and then I love it how it's actually come. So if you like to have some design and peel off, you can uh, put any nail, you can just cover it with the tape, uh, like sticky tape, what it's um, slippery, and then you can peel off easy uh, your design from the top. It's just like one of the options it's for, if it's not enough for you here uh, for your uh, designs, you see. So in here we have as well, um, quite a lot of them just to practicing different shapes and here you can as well do it like a shape design and then you write down the price what you use it you know so it's uh, as well nice not only for the clients it's as well nice for nail technicians so in here we have as well different design one of them it's laminated so you can draw and after you wipe it you draw and you wipe it so like that design, you can see nice flowers, you can uh, wipe it or you can peel off when you like your design, uh, like how to show, how to use it and how I'm use it. I will show you just now on the, on the video. So in here we have as well different shape. You can see as well, we're planning a lot, a lot and a lot. You can see here quite a um, few pages for you to practice and, and what it's actually as well nice about it, we have it for pedicure. So you can um, plant some pedicures design here. You can draw some flowers or maybe some French with stones. And then you can here write down uh, how much it will be cost and what you use as well, quite a few pages. So like that, the book, it's help a lot with the drawing and with the plan, your design with for your memory, because believe me, this, this is book you are start today and then you're uh, finding this book after a few years, even like one, two, five years, you will see exactly different. Plus you will use it, this design for your um, crea uh, creation and for your client. As well, I want to show you one more page what it's missed in here is the page with the nail art as well bright one i just use it my favorite um, stickers or water deco and you can draw on the top you can put a base coat or you can put top coat you draw in after you peel off and stick it to the nails how to show you i'm gonna show you just now about halloween it's gonna be soon halloween and you can use this Halloween designs as well for your art. Here we have a Barbie, here we have uh, different flowers and here we have butterflies. So like I say, it's all that you see quite a lot for you to practice in and quite a lot for you to try on. And now I'm gonna show you exactly how to use it and how to create your design to, to, this, to use this book. 
So let's I show you how I create design. In here I have a gel polish with color. Uh, you don't have to put gel polish. You can draw with markers or with pencils. Um, I just use an easy way. I just show you exactly how I am create and how to show you, for example, how to use it. So in here um, I am apply my uh, gel paint, gel polish, uh, gel polish, gel polish, number 21, 23 and number 16. So brand it's QD, this one it's uh, mini fox, it's small bottles like that. So in here I'm apply as well everything. And uh, I will uh, use small brush, uh, seven millimeters. So in here I am drawing one brush. So, uh, so seven uh, millimeter, millimeter, milliliter millimeters and then I use gel polishes and black I think okay so my <laughs> my writing in English it's not so great so just you understand so I writing for myself black paint on gel so this is what I use and in here I use a liner Uh, so, uh, like you can use as well uh, to write something like what stones you use, what color you use. Sometimes it's help a lot acrylic, what color acrylic you use as well. You can apply in here acrylic as well, just make not too wet. Uh, and um, the, it's not all of them, like I say for you, it's not all of them laminated. But if you want to, to apply something what it's um, runny, what it's like acrylic, you can put just sticky tape on top and then it's gonna stay perfectly. So I am already tested, I know exactly. It's just if I'm laminated all, the book uh, first of all it's gonna be costly a lot and sometimes we don't actually need it uh, most of the planner books we are not needed all of them be laminated so like that I am apply here uh, what color I use what I use and what I'm doing so I will use as well my palette and I do like like tiger print not tiger, um, like cheetah print. So in here you draw what, what you want to do this on the design, what you use on the design. In here, if I wanted, for example, right, I wanted some uh, flowers, so I can do some flowers design. If I want to use on this design uh, on down. I prepare to use uh, for practicing liner gel because it's not have sticky layer so my gels will not be stick to another pages so just like I say for example I cure it for it's not run away anyway and I will use a matte top coat. So matte top coat, I use a cashmere top coat or velvet top coat or velour top coat. We have a different names, but they all matte. So I like a velour top coat. So I will use a velour top coat, but I will use velour top coat in top of my drawing. So in here it's, I'm practicing and in here I will draw my design. You can put glitter as well if you wanted to. So 
so like that and in here you want to draw kitty or you just want to live like that um, if I will do it I probably do some on the end you know something like this and cure it you straight away can put lamp on top like this and put good amount for you can cure just be careful with your brush don't cure your brush okay now I will use matte top coat to cover it my design don't have to be perfect you want to do perfect you can do it perfect but just for you like planner you know and I cure it as well and in the meantime when it's curing here I can put top coat as well on these designs in here on here for it's not be sticky and on this one so you can see how cool it is you can see already design it's here and you write down what you use what you apply and blah 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 so it's very very cool so on here you can do exactly the same things and so now we are going to the practicing with the nail art nail art and here we have uh, laminated so this one is for practicing to make sure it is working very well for you and you can wipe it and put it again wipe it and put it again so it's as well make much easier your life and I will show you just few uh, tricks what I use it and like if you will do from scratch from here so it's line and line if you will do you probably will do like this and it's not gonna work it's gonna be more not sharp and here we have a sharp you can see so we have to draw as well with line like that as well one one and like that stars so they're practicing you see this um this uh, what they call it swirls so normally people will do it from here I am do it from the middle like this then we can go to another one for example heart And if you want to use heart on your design, we can do that as well. So like that, you practice in here and let's I show you this example heart, but you can use as well heart, you can do triangles, you can do lines as well, the same things. I will clean it here.
where I'm practicing and in here where I use it my heart I will cure it so I will use my reflection gel its base coat what it's reflected and I cure it when I'm done. Just in here, <clears throat> I think it's a little bit too much, so I'm just remove a little bit. Like that. Here it is. So you can see how cute it is. And I am cured. Make sure your brush not dry. And now I have it tips here. I just apply quickly base coat. I will use tweezer. And I peel off my heart. Just make sure it's on the side. You keep it here. And remove it. Where is my... And keep... Ta -da! So you can see how cute it is. You can as well draw if you wanted to after when it's cured let's put a little bit more up here I will use here just to finish my design. You can see it's very simple and easy. Like that. And how I say it's a reflection on the light. If I use my light here. You can see it's reflected and it shows differently. It gives kind of glitter. Cure it. And then you put top coat. So exactly the same we do with all designs. Okay, and let's do one more design let's do horse or some writing or b let's do b So in here we have a B. I use it base coat.
our beads yellow make sure you don't put too much you can see color but you still see a black spot and I cover all your bee completely Mustache or antenna, how you call it, I will not cover it. I will leave it how it is. Put the lamp. Cure it. Normally it's dry very fast. And I will use black paint for details. Okay, now I'm apply base coat. Little bit of yellow, like honey. And base coat, they are very um, like flexible, so you can add it just small, small layer, and it's already perfect. You can see. And when you're happy, what it look like, you cure it. As well, it help if you have lamp like this. Then it's easier. What you do, you put it on. Then you hold it nicely. If it's designed like quite big like I have. To make sure everything everywhere. And you put it on the lamp just for a few seconds. Then I finish my design and antenna. And you don't have to think in how I gonna draw that because in here it's everything what you need. Okay, one more design we have here flower. Just we're gonna add it as well. I have blue. Okay. 
base coat and we're gonna do something like this flower like here I will add it for I still can see background where I can add it black or as well if, even if you don't know but you see it's still difficult for you to understand where to go where is the leaves you start to draw around and it's clumps square so you can use even like this way and then here i can add a flower and on top i will add it as well some uh, design some details So I put a little bit base coat, just make sure it's not too much. And now I will add the details. So you can see flower in here we have a leaves, in here we have a center of the flower. We can change it a little bit this flower. But at least you know exactly where to start. you can see it's come designed so like that you can use the book how you want it to so and then it will be just more perfect and more perfect and when you are start to draw in the book when you are already feel proportion when you feel already how thick your line have to be then slowly slowly you're gonna go away from the book but when you just started it's i think it's the best option to make create creativity for your nice design so let's do a last one what we will have for a halloween so i prepare here uh, my nail and in here I will use it Halloween design so let's do a cat like this one uh, remember my gel it's a uh, flexible rubber base gel and uh, if it's flexible background it is make much easier for me so what I do I pick up any color what it's in here I have yellow for example just to uh, make first layer flexible
otherwise if it's not gonna be flexible and when you draw and you will peel off it's so much small details it might be broke but with the base coat you can see exactly it's covered and seal everything so first layer just a little bit you know just to make sure your design it will be perfect I will use as well white uh, for the eyes and the nose but after when I'm done already with design And now I start with the face, cat face. So now you can see our cat is ready and let's dry it. So now so long I am apply base coat and I remove my cat. I start from the bottom and slowly slowly peel off. So you can see it's perfectly shaped. So I put my lamp on. Now just make sure my tail is in and everything is in.
I will use white paint, remember, for eyes and nose. very very tiny so I will use it to speak like this <laughs> cute and if you want it you can add it some stuff like you know your imagination like my imagination it can be a blood job like this. I always have imagination, you know. <laughs> so it's never gonna be finished. Voila. Quick and easy. And here I have designed what we done. It's so long. So we can put a top coat on top. We can put anything like matte or shiny. It's up to you. But then here you can prepare yourself just for a nice Halloween time or some design as well like but i do plain and simple you know when you are more and more and more practicing then you can go for more complicated we do exactly the same things so when you are apply uh, for example mickey mouse you wanted to put mickey mouse you are first put a uh, yellow base coat because it's flexible and then your draw on top and even red you can add it on top just have to be patient and use small small brushes i use it small brushes seven millimeters but it's make my life very easy it's very very tiny ones or if you have a smaller than that what i don't see it before <laughs> so you might be get even better details i hope you enjoyed the video and i hope you are uh, enjoy the book as well so we have available digital uh, and, and you can print yourself uh, where if you're not from south africa if you are like to have a, a physical book you can order as well online uh, on the link below so you can see it uh, under the comment and where is the video uh, ending under the video you can see link for a website where is book and i gonna edit as well digital uh, book version where you can edit in as well you can use it for yourself uh, editing it means you can remove the logo if you don't need it maybe you need for your um, you know for your design or maybe for your own school so I hope you enjoy it and uh, see you next time.